I will be doing a workout video today and I have gone through those workout videos on YouTube and I picked out one that I will be working out with them today. So I picked out this one called uh, Fitness Blender Cardio Workout at Home. And the plan is I will try to do the workout without stopping. So the only thing that I will have uh, on, I will not be listening, I will not be able to listen to the instruction, but I will just be following what I see them do exactly because I will be having my headphones on or listening to music and I will not stop. The plan is not to stop at all. Maybe I'll stop to drink water quickly, depends. Um, then yeah, so the downside to it is I am the one recording myself, I'm the one filming myself, so I will not be able to have different angles of me doing the exercise. So that's yeah, so I just have to make do with the camera standing on its own and me doing the exercise. So Okay, so here we go. So like I said, this is called Fitness Blender. Can you believe that this video has over 56 million views on YouTube? 56 times people try to watch this video. But yeah, look at me doing my warm-up. I'm watching the video as I'm doing this exercise, so I'll, I'm not able to listen to what they're saying, the instructions that they're giving, because I have my headphones on. But I, from time to time, I look at the screen and see what they're doing, and I do exactly what they do. And here is me, happy to start my exercise. I think, yeah, I was very geared up for this. So we're still doing warm-ups with this one, moving shoulders from side to side. So it's a lateral step, kind of a side lunge, doing a nice long motion with those arms, so stretching out in front of your chest, then squeezing them back behind you, constantly working against yourself. So you want those muscles working against your, those uh, arms, so your bicep and tricep working against themselves, your chest and your rhomboids working against themselves, trying to get a full range of motion and warm up that upper body. Really focus on that step as well, opening up those hips, getting those legs nice and warmed up. We've got just a couple seconds left until we switch to squats. And go ahead and switch it. This is just a traditional squat. Feet again. This was so easy for me. Doing squats is so easy. It's something that I, you know, love to do. Although it's it's cardio in general, but this is like I love doing squats. I love I love working on my glutes. So yeah, that's why I didn't want to stop, even though they were having a break. <laughs> but yeah, that was the end of the warm up, and now we're starting the actual exercise. So this is like a cheap version of burpees <laughs> i actually thought it was burpees she was doing but then i looked again and i saw that she wasn't actually jumping she was doing you know just halfway burpees and yes i didn't do it properly because if you notice notice i wasn't able to go all the way down properly because the floor was very slippery you could see the f my feet was like sliding backwards. So yes, um, I would have done a better burpee than that. All right, let's go and move into a jumping jack. 
Nice full range of motion. Nice quick motion. Again, barely letting those feet touch the ground before you're jumping them back in the opposite direction. Keep those lungs open, breathing constantly. Make sure you never hold your breath. Just keep that motion under control at a nice, constant pace. Got about 10 seconds left till we switch back to that active rest. Four, three, two, one, and jog in place. That's one of each. We've got one more of each of these exercises and we'll move to the next group. So once we're done with this active rest, we're moving back to that slow burpee. In three, two, one, and start that slow burpee up again. Again, nice slow controlled motion. One foot at a time goes out, one foot at a time comes back in. Make sure you're alternating which foot you start with or which foot you lead with every single time. Keep those lungs open. Make sure you're really trying to focus on getting a nice full range of motion. Take the time to get those hips nice and low. Every single time you extend those legs out back behind you. Just keep it going. Got 10 seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one, and active rest. Jogging in place. I keep doing it without looking at the screen. I don't know when they stop and when they start. Yeah, that's the downside of not listening to the audio. Because I have my music full on blast, keeping me occupied. Yeah, that's why I'm not able to follow precisely when they stop and when they start. But you know, as long as I keep in motion, I don't stop. It's all good, it's still part of the exercise. Four, three, two, one, and let it relax. Good job, that's our first round down. Let's go ahead and get ready for our next. how slippery the floor the floor is I think the shoe and the floor aren't a very good combination as you can really trying to challenge yourself now again just keep those lungs open make sure you're breathing normally never hold your breath got about 10 seconds left until we switch that active rest and five four three two one and jog in place get those feet moving again this is just whatever you need to to kind of recover a little bit to get into that next exercise so if you're not really all that tired you can always make it harder if you are tired you can always make it easier and we're moving to those ventral jacks next and go ahead and switch it those arms come straight up in front of your body this is almost the same exact motion as a regular jumping jack the only difference is that arm motion so instead of Lateral step and reach again. Nice full range of motion. Make sure you have a really nice full stretch, stretching those hands up above your head every single time you come back to the center. And you're getting a really good rotation to those shoulders and a nice deep lunge every single time you go off to the sides. Again, just keep those lungs open. Keep a nice even pace. You can always speed this. Go ahead and start them up. Arms come straight up in front of that chest. 
pause right at shoulder height and then right back down, slap in the front of that thigh and then back up again. Again, make it as quick of a motion as you can control, just making sure everything is nice and controlled. You don't have anything going uh, flailing around or uh, loose. You wanna make sure that arm and that leg are both really nice and tight. What was that? What was I doing? <laughs> oh my god, watching this now, no, that was rubbish. That was, that was no control whatsoever. Like, <laughs> oh my god, no, no, stop. Well, guys, listen, I'm going to get better at this. I'm going to try it again, and I will make sure I do it properly next time because this was not, this was not it. No, 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 sorry. This, I'm sorry to embarrass myself like this in public. This wasn't, you know, I thought I was killing it when I was doing it. Now watching this, no way come apart so nice big full range of motion again try to keep everything nice and tight those legs and those arms never let those arms or legs uh, out of control never let them go loose just keep that motion going keep those lungs open got just about 10 seconds left five four three two one and switch that active rest Oh boy, we're back at this exercise again. This high knee pause thing. No, it's not my thing. <laughs> oh, I'm so, oh my God. Oh no, no. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. This is not how to do it. Knee as high as you possibly can in that range of motion. Nice quick movement. Just 10 seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one, and back to that active rest. Try to recover as best you can. Nice deep breath. Three, two, one, and back to those fly jacks. Nice big motion right in front of that chest. Try to get those arms to come actually back behind your chest just a little bit, so get a really good stretch of that shoulder as well as that, uh, getting that full range of motion in front of that chest. Just keep it going, quick motion, keep those core muscles nice and tight, keep those lungs open. Sorry, I'm gonna have to do a voiceover because music was playing in the in the background and I don't want YouTube to flag this video. So this is the end of the first half. So they have taken a break and I will be stopping at this point. And how do you guys think I did? Leave it in the comment section below and let me know how you think I did. I personally think I did well. I didn't think this was a very challenging workout. Um, but some of the moves, I couldn't do it precisely. I am usually off balance when it comes to doing one-legged jumps or balancing on the one leg but anyway thank you guys for watching this video cracked me up watching it play back and see you in the next video thanks for watching bye bye